drink. That requires a few things. Are we gonna drink this time? What are we gonna drink? We're gonna make a drink this time? Yeah, yeah. That's awesome. We should yeah, totally we should, do that. We, we should do that more often. We, we, we should do it whenever, like, whenever we hit record, really. I mean, yeah. That would be. Let's, no, let's no make reason that not a to plan. Every you know time. You know what I love about this drink? It's got everything. The glass it's going into. Look at this. Boom! Thing. Ultimate beer mug. Ultimate now, beer mug. I don't know necessarily if we need it all. I'm, I'm curious on how much we'll fill it. Well, it's a 9, 15, 16, 17. It's about, it's almost 15, 20 ounces of So half of this. Liquid. Is there any ice going in it? Yeah, there is. Then we can... Ah, but Jesus, still. that's going to hurt. This well, is our first drink of the week? Yeah, that's why I did it first. <laughs> so, we, so we get a chance to get drunk and then level I up? I wanted to get it out of the way. I'm glad I want to really, drive home. I really want to start <laughs> hardcore. Well, because this is this week this is what I did. So the first two recipes are really more sweet or sour, like, foo-foo recipes. Chick okay. drinks. Okay. This is probably... I don't know what this fits into. This is... This could be good. This could be bad. I have no idea. This is a frat boy drink. Maybe. I like passion fruit juice. Oh. That's that's my driving factor for I'm making this recipe. Interested to try the flavors in this. Yeah. But I'm not interested to drink the whole thing. No. That's what Jennifer. That's what Jennifer's for. Jennifer's for. <laughs> so what? <laughs> this, How did I become the guinea pig? Because no one can see when you get hammered. There's <laughs> <laughs> some, some truth to that. Right. I can see later. Yeah. Um, the the recipe. So how did that legs burger work out for you last week? That was a pretty good drink. Uh, okay. Oh, it didn't work out. No, that's great. Sorry, Jen. Sorry. We need more of them. Um, okay. That was a tasty. We drank half that, so I know, and she got the other half. Yeah, but you're like she's you stretch. So, yeah. okay. so this week, this recipe submitted by Dorian was actually submitted Dorian. a little bit ago. Uh, we're gonna the, the English version is called the Pass Out Cocktail. If you did the translation, it's Abstrusalism. The yeah. Abstrus Lusung cocktail. So that's that. If you take Abstrus, which is more like collapse, and then Lusung, which we were explaining before the show, is more like answers or, or solutions or things that are you find at the back of an answer key. Now, is Dorian from Germany? No, I think so. Okay. So, and given my German thing, that I can usually speak some. The some fact that German, you're fluent. Not quite. I wouldn't go fluent. Somebody will blow my mind. Are you kidding? Okay. I've heard, you know, but you can go to Germany. Go, no, you can go to Germany them. and you can get around. Oh, in yeah, 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 You're yeah, fluent. Yeah, in German. But, and you could, you have to start to think in German. That's the trick. Um, but there's words I just don't know. If somebody came, first off, Abschlussung is not. Oh, it's. I think that's. Uh, it's. They bring the words together. It's not a word. Yeah. You can't look it up in the dictionary. You can't look at it and say there's two I had words. Break it, right? and these are the words, and oh, I understand yeah. what this word. So what I did is I broke it into the two the two main root words to kind of because I think it's abstrusion. But either way, you put them together, and drunk people probably come up with new words. Sure, why not? Right, and, and there's always like colloquialisms that right. Are and I think this regional, is so. now for this. I also decided we're going to shake it in this because I can't think of anything else that can make. I can't think of another shaker that you have that's going to fit everything. Right, in. this should be able to fit it all. Oh, that's 600 beautiful. ml. We are about to find out. We might have to do a two shaker thingy. Uh, we can shake part of it in here. No, I'm just. Well, saying. you know what we do? We fill it and we figure out. We, we make it audible. You know what? Let's find out. Right, that's what I mean. So the recipe for this is. Oh yeah yeah. Uh oh. -uh. You want what? Okay okay. So one and a half ounces of light rum, one and a half ounces of amaretto. We're using Di Serono. We're using Bacardi for the light rum. Uh, one and a half ounces of vodka. We got some Absolute. Three quarter ounce of bourbon. We picked out some wild turkey. Three quarter ounces of coffee liquor. We got the Capula. Capali. Capali. Capula. That's the Hawaiian Capula. version. We got three quarter ounces of high proof rum. We got some Bacardi 151. Two ounces of grenadine and oh. six and three quarter ounces of passion six fruit and juice. Six three quarters, really? Okay, here's. <laughs> I can tell you why. I can explain uh, this. I think it's funny, but okay. What, what's the? I don't know. What, this was submitted from a German person. Oh, CLs. MLs. MLs. I think okay. maybe CLs. You might be right on that one. MLs only used in a couple places, like Queens country. Uh, high proof three quarters. So, like, is it the New York borough, or are you talking like England? <laughs> no, I'm talking about England. Okay. <laughs> the borough no, in not New York. Queens, New York. No. Okay. And so, yes, when you they use milliliters down there. When you do <laughs> that conversion, know. you end up with a lot of three quarters e type things. Like one and a half was really. He gave me one point six eight or that some random. You know, if you do the conversion, it doesn't come out right. We're gonna do. So here's your sweetener. Two ounces. Now I brought another one because you did because you knew you were low. I was knew I was low, and I'm happy because I've been using this bottle for so long. When is it gonna go? Well, I opened this one by mistake that time when we lost the grenadine. Oh yes. yes so yes, being yes, able to yes. tap into it's always good. Let's just tap Dude, into it. there is a lot of sugar in here. All right. But I guess we're feeding the candida in our bellies. There's a lot of everything. A lot of candida. I don't know what candida is, but it well, must be sugar. 
Candida's yeast. Mm -hmm. Oh, I didn't she know. knows. She's like, yeah, I knew this. What's wrong with you, noob? I watched an infomercial about probiotics, so oh, I know all yeah. about Candida so and Candida did, overgrowth. Yeah. And I ordered a bunch of probiotics. <laughs> <laughs> you're failing at you're you're doing exactly what they wanted you to do. I know, but they may be right. So, okay, that was hard. Is this fresh squeezed passengers? Fresh, fresh yeah. juice? No. I don't know. If I fresh squeeze that, it would take a lot more passion fruit. I don't know that you got six hundred quarter ounces in there. Have you ever seen passion fruit? Is there? Yeah, they have them at. Uh, I don't have. Have you seen the insides is, of passion fruit? How'd it come out? That's six. That's three quarters. I didn't eyeball. You eyeballed that. Well, I sell these things, so I know about that. Pretty the, the, freaking perfect. <laughs> when I do the measurements, I know that they count this as six, and then the rest is kind of just you kind of wow. go. So I know that. Did I really? Yeah. I think he measured it. I think he's lying. No, I, I it was too lazy. <laughs> I, don't, I don't want this. It it's impressive. I'm, I'm impressed. <laughs> <laughs> you, get, you did the these right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah I, I got. It. I yeah. That's the only one I haven't oh, put on the floor. Fudge. Fudge goes. It's red. That's boozy. I love these ice cubes. Now what are you gonna? I'm gonna shake it this way. Oh Jesus. <laughs> See, there's so much liquor in here, it doesn't make the normal no. liquid in here. It doesn't make the normal, like, shaker sounds. I feel no. like we can talk over this. Just because it's full. It looks like a Bloody Mary. It does, doesn't it? it? looks like a fruit punch. Oh, that's what it tastes like. A bloody fruit punch. Bloody fruit punch. We need to make that out of blood oranges. Yeah, a blood orange, blood oranges with Bloody Mary mix and yeah. some, like, All right. sweetness to it. Someone in the chat room says you're wrong. ML is used everywhere in the world. Ounces is only used in one or two countries. Like the U.S. Yeah. No, but CL. that's not true. CL. I've had CLs used. CL is. A, I've had this argument with multiple people. Where it's I the say, same system. S but CL centiliters and milliliters are the yeah. Centiliters are like ten or a hundred milliliters. No. I am not contesting that ML or, no, or ounces are used everywhere because they're obviously not. What? Were you here? Were no. you here? Thanks for tuning in, Jen. <laughs> <laughs> and then he said, looks like fruit punch, and I said a bloody fruit punch. Uh -huh. And then Jen joins in. <laughs> so how it looks is like a bloody Mary. fruit punch different than, a, I mean, wow. saying it's a bloody Mary? That's significantly more than half booze, uh -huh. isn't it? It's like eight, eight and three quarter, and then we get nine. I could have reduced quarter. the ingredients, but I wanted some shock factor. This is a shock. Jesus. Order one of those at your no, little bar. See Jesus what you get. Jesus is not going to help you with this one. No, unless he turns it into water. That would be boring. It would be bad. It started as water. Yeah. It looks like it could taste really good, though. Mmm. It got mmm. Mm. It's got a little bit of a, a kick to it. Oh my god, there's booze in there. Sour. It's sour, there's sweet, there's. Here's the thing, though. There are so many cocktails that we've made and everybody makes that they use mm. pineapple juice and orange juice to build out, right? It's passion always the fruit's interesting. completely different. It's different. And it right? has a flavor to it. Obviously. Yeah, it's it tastes like flavor. passion fruit, which is the best fruit ever. And I don't even think it's really a fruit. I think it's a vine. How much alcohol is in the drink? All of it. <laughs> Good call. So we got uh, nine and three quarter ounces. So and nine then, ounces. And there's eight and three quarter ounces of non-alcohol. So it's so mostly more alcohol. alcohol. Here's the thing. It's also got 151. Yes. So we the count others, that double. Right. Where the uh, yeah, you, you would count it as more than no, no you wouldn't. You're right. It's about, it's about double. A little less, but whatever. So we'll say nine. We'll say ten ounces of booze in there. Right. So ten ounces of booze. I don't know how you figure out the ABV because I'm just I can't do that in my head. But you got to take out. Well, it depends all the liquids. what liquors you use too. Right. You got to take out everything with probably 40 ABV except for that. Yeah. Um, in the 151, obviously. Yeah. And so. Well, this is 40 proof. Oh, really? The proof, not percent. Right. These are all 80 proof, right? Right. So 40% and all, all 40 proof. Yeah, I 40 see what you're proof. Saying. Yeah, so that's about. Ah, right. you screwed me up. That makes sense. So it's still about 10 ounces of 40 proof in there. So what? About probably five, proof. four to five ounces of pure alcohol. So it's 40%. Yeah, so it's four or five ounces of alcohol in right. there. And pure alcohol, not like, yeah. oh, five ounces of alcohol, like I just did five yeah. shots of vodka. Now that would be no. like, well, I like that shot. Um, or, or, or more because vodka is 40%. You so. want right. a question of the day? I will, yeah. Not right now. If you have one, I can do it now. Mm -hmm. I haven't explained the drink. It's a good time to answer. Whoa! It's gonna head rubbing action. 
gets was the it. question, is there going to be a sale? No. Yes. <laughs> what is the most obnoxious gar garnish you've ever seen? Most obnoxious garnish you've ever seen. Right now, say it. Right, right there, because you're going to say pineapple spear. And the second one is... Oh, a banana. Do you banana. believe in Whole beer banana. goggles? Beer goggles. Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. Um, that's a thing. <laughs> that's a thing. <laughs> yeah, that's and a thing. <laughs> what is, what's the, the spear on the on the pineapple? That the spear, the this, the leaf. You know the pineapple leaf. Oh, like the uh, awesome garnish. The top of it. The yeah. I've I think we it's have done the pineapple leaf. Yeah, we have Not done really some called. obnoxious garnishes, and I I'm proud Someone of that. Someone said something about a fish being okay. That's not a that's garnish pretty obnoxious. for a Bloody Mary. Mm. I think I've heard of that actually. Do you make a do you make a um a parachute not a parachute a fly on <laughs> you bend the fish and put a big like apple around it so it looks like a like a fly That'd be nasty instead of having the, what the orange hell are you talking about you know how you, <laughs> I a fly this. is an orange slice with the cherry in the middle okay yeah now replace the orange slice with a fish okay and then put an apple on the middle <laughs> you got and the fish is big so you got to make everything big <laughs> okay just do a cherry then. Oh, okay. So from a tasting note perspective, because everybody's like lurching into their monitors, like, what does it taste like? Yeah, it's, it's not bad. No, I mean, it's, it's got. Do, how much do you like passion fruit? I like passion fruit. It's I pretty like good. Passion fruit. passion fruit is tasty. I like sweet things. Like, Smells like, like brown sugar and passion fruit. Mm. I don't really know why. Oh, the grenadine probably yeah. like that. Just a raw sweetness. There's a there's a lot of flavors going on in there. There's, yeah. It's not like one of those like we did like the Razzle Death Tea or something. No, that was <laughs> terrible. It was just a bunch of booze in there and, and it tasted terrible. It missed what that missed and what brings us together Balance. instead of bitters is the passion fruit brings mm. it together. The passion fruit is both sweet and sour. It's got a astringent. An astringent's bad idea. A tart yeah. bite to it, right? Yeah, there's a pucker at the back end of that. Right. And then on top of that, you've got the the grenadine, which is going to basically be two ounces of balance against the mm. 151s, the vodkas, everything else. Yep. And then you get the coffee, like finish coffee. that ends yeah, in coffee. Because right. what I was tasting, it almost, to me, this is... Yeah, I've completely forgot about that. That's This reminds me, when the first alcohol I think of that's not actually in here, is the herring cherry liqueur. Yes. Like, it yeah. has that... That's smokiness yeah. from that coffee liquor. Yeah. yeah. This is this is obnoxious, but a good yeah. build of... I don't... Like, the amaretto's in here someplace. It is, yeah. But you know, it's a great balance. You, what you gotta do with this drink is you gotta make it as a punch and serve it in smaller glasses. Oh, yeah, yeah. You right? are, I mean, this... If, if you are a bar at a bar, first off, besides the fact that you'd be arrested... Yeah, if you, you would serve, serve that somebody at most bars. this, you would be the most famous bar in the world, which is probably why they don't let you do that. Yeah. Because I'm like, oh, I was get one drink. This would you cost would, you, you effectively would... like sixty dollars. Yeah, like at a bar. That's basically a six pack of beer in a glass, <laughs> alcohol content wise. I mean, right, but there's... you're going to. But it's so much easier to drink than a six pack of beer. It's sweet. It go... Unless it's. I could probably drink that in about. Six seconds, if I had to. <laughs> right, <laughs> you would be wrecked. I would be wrecked. <laughs> right. I mean, the only you'd way you'd be on could, the ground. For I would the rest probably of the night. What, be lying in a puddle of my own urine and puke. Right. <laughs> what you need to do is you need to take six cans of natty ice, poke a hole in all of them. Right. Tape them so that they're sealed, probably with like masking tape, in a big tube. And then go like this. How about you just dump them all into a big tube and then? Because that, again, that's really intricate. I like that you put so much thought into that. You lose the wow factor if you just put okay. in a big tube. Right. Then you're just doing a big tube of beer. Yeah. That's all fun. But you can't drink six. Six Natty Ices is going to be in a glass this wide. It's going to be up to here. So you're drinking that much li liquid yeah. as opposed to this much Plus liquid. the carbonation would kill you. Yeah. No carbonation. No carbonation. Yeah. So it's, gonna, it's nice and smooth. It doesn't smooth. matter how small your pipe is. No. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> This is good. Wait a minute. I like the front end, back end sweetness, striking tart <laughs> ending. Later. Yeah, I like it too. Uh, a little syrupy? I, I would, yeah, it is syrupy. I was thinking this was going to be a terrible drink. Just looking at the ingredients and looking at how much I'll tell you what saved it. There. The thing that we sell at Austin Drinks right here. Yeah, the grenadine. Brothers saves this drink. Well, that's great grenadine too. Yes. It really is. If you use a cheap grenadine, it might be overly sweet. This has yeah. much more rich, dark flavors because it this does. is a, a better, uh, a superior product over the crap that you can it, buy from like... Uh, what's the company? Roses. Roses. It's right. like getting the good, like, maraschino, like maraschino cherries. cherries yeah. It's the same thing. You, you get the crappy maraschino cherries, or not the crappy, the store brand, right. whatever it is, versus these, and there's a noticeable difference. Oh, yeah! I mean, the these, only way this can be better awesome. is you put seven of these on a, on a, on a stick across it. No! <laughs> I'm just putting them <laughs> That's back like 
$100. If you put like $20 worth of cherries on here, or six of those. <laughs> wow. Well, it's a $20 bottle, so That's you crazy. break that out, divide that by 30. You do that in a high. A this high can be a very expensive drink, no matter how you do yeah. it. Good. I, for a drink that I thought was going to just be, we're just doing it because. It's obscene? Yeah. Yeah. Like, this yeah. is like epic mealtime proportion level of <laughs> stupidness. But at the same time, how often... Now, epic mealtime... Muscle glasses. To, drink the drink. <laughs> <laughs> epic mealtime has to make this. If you guys watch that show, you should submit this uh, this video and say, make this drink. They can even butcher up the abstract of this one. They come up with it. Yeah. Like, whatever. And you know what? They can bake it into a hamburger that's 10 pounds. <laughs> yes. Because that's what they do. Somebody in the chat room says the proof on the drink has to be about 350 or so. 350 units proof. of... Proof? That means it's 175% uh, alcohol. Divide it. You can't be 175% alcohol, especially when there's non-alcoholic stuff in there. <laughs> right? I mean, yeah. Is that not true? Well, anything over 200 proof is, is more than pure alcohol. You can't make 200 proof alcohol. 200 you can proof only go 198. That's pure alcohol. Something happens at the last two percentage. I've read about it. I think okay. it just turns into a gas or something. I don't know. You right, can't so get it to 200 exact. Really? Well, that's kind of interesting. It, it, I did not it's know physics that. or chemistry or whatever you want to call it. Yeah, science. look it up. It's science. It's science, bitch. It's science, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> this is good. Um, we got to just stop this show because yeah. this is good. You know who would like this? Antonin Laquay, he would love this. Would, <laughs> was that a your shout, shout out? out, buddy? I got gotcha. you. Antonin would like this, except in France, this is like $175 worth of stuff to make this. That's true. Totally worth it. All right, we're done. De All this awesome stuff. Definition of worth it. You know what this thing needs? Bitters. Macadamia nut bitters. <laughs> That stuff is awesome. <laughs> I, I think I, you would kind of get lost in there. I don't know. Oh, you just need a double your You Good haven't morning. tried this yet. It's not as like in your face as you think it is. No, maybe it's so sweet. It is really like I sweet. feel stickiness. Yeah. Well, you got the. I feel dirty drinking this. You know, grenadine, coffee liquor, everything. It's got everything. When you drink that whole thing, you're gonna feel a lot more dirty. Rum is distilled from sugar, so I mean, it's got di the, sugar distilled out. Everything's sugar. Everything's here. sugar. And by the end of the whole week's filming, this is gonna be gone, and Jennifer's gonna have drank all. Oh, it's gonna be awesome. Yeah. Uh, no. So she, she she doesn't think so, but she hasn't tried it. Because I happy. will be. Peeing myself. <laughs> peeing yourself. And I'll be Instagramming that stuff. I was going to say, you can probably just go to the bathroom if you need to pee. Jen's peeing herself. Oh, there it is. Instagram. Oh, my God. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> just like, duh. Look, now this is pee we got to get you a, a skirt for the desk so I can't yeah. do the pee shots. Yeah. Pee shot. <laughs> pee shot. We could make a whole different type of YouTube show. Ding. Yeah. Um, <laughs> So anyway, if you're interested in making a crazy cocktail, there you go. That's your ultimate beer glass. Absolute what? Absolutely. Absolutely. In your beer glass, the pass out cocktail for those in English. You can get these two great things. Not the liquid, just the glass. At Ostrace.com. Along with this. And this. Product placement. And this. Holy crap. I guess this is what happens when you're in a store. And this. And this. And this. You can get all this stuff at awesomedrinks.com. Anyway. Anything you need. All barware needs. All your barware needs. I gotta go wash this. It's all sticky. EverydayDrinkers.com for all the rest of the stuff. That is the content. Oh, by the way. We're still gonna do this. I guess somebody who actually sent the recipe saying, this is for the tea bag content. So if you want to enter the tag bag contest, create yourself a brand new custom tiki gla a tiki cocktail. It has to be tiki themed. That means do things that would go, oh yeah, that's a tiki cocktail. We'll build them, we're gonna taste them, we're gonna test them, and then we're gonna judge and find a winner. And four winners are gonna get tag bag. So tag you can bag. crush your ice. Boom, boom. This is called the Lewis bag. Look it up. Hey, you, know, you take your wooden muddler here and you You beat the crap out of it. Throw your ice in there, boom, boom. So if and if you don't want to wait, you can go buy these on Awesome Drinks as well. That's it. Submit your recipes. I've got six so far. Four people are gonna win. That means we only have two losers. You guys are gonna make the competition a little bit harder. Not sixty though. No. Yeah. <laughs> Not sixty. Is there a limit? Are you putting a limit on this? I didn't really think about it. I just you do think this after stuff. the Hendrix, ah, you would have thought about that. That was so long ago. The Hendrix was forgot. a big, huge bag, though. This is just okay. This is smaller. It's, it's like small. childbirth. You just forget all the pain, and you're just like, oh, there oh, we goes. should do that again. Exactly. <laughs> <Okay. laughs> so, so what do you know about childbirth? <laughs> I was waiting. I was waiting for at least five, six seconds, and she. You gotta get on top of this. I stuff. took a class. <laughs> so I, I had to. They made me. 
I took an EMT class, so oh, no, had, like a whole. Class. Oh, yeah. in case you have to go yeah. pick up the pregnant lady that's he can, out the kid. Sir, he can deliver children. I could have till I expired. My license expired. <laughs> <laughs> I can't do anything after I expire. Now he's like a bad can of olives. Yeah, because then you're a zombie. <laughs> anyway, we're done. You're a walker. We're done. <laughs> you're a walker. Day walker. Yeah, we're teaching you a drink.